Oh, yeah, count. that's that's like the, the <laughs> That's a really bad SDI combo. Oh yeah. That's the like the early training room Bayo combo, like, oh this is sick guys. I promise. <laughs> <laughs> so now we have Hawk and uh Kaysen back. This another match to make it out of pools, I'm assuming. Uh Hawk pre previously playing Mario, we're now seeing the Ike come out. Oh yeah. Ike is his other like main you could say. It's like Mario Ike. Um, but I've I've seen so many different characters from Hawk. And Kaysen, we've seen previously, like I said, against Puffin. He made light work of Puffin, um, and he's really explosive with his ZSS play, I oh, tell yeah. you. So maybe Hawk's bringing this, the slow Ike, the slow hard hitting Ike to the table to try and mitigate this explosive gameplay. There's going to be a nice com uh, combo conversion from Kaysen, just getting that percent, not expecting to take that stock unless Hawk's DI was just god awful. Okay, yep. Hawk drifted away to a point where boost kick would not have connected, so that was good from Kaysen to just uh, retreat to stage, try to push his advantage more. Immediate fire back with that forward air, stopping all the momentum that Kaysen had, trying to get a follow up. All right, grab yep. to the forward, th into that, the forward air. Excuse me. That up throw forward air connects for like ever. It on really does. Yeah, it is, it is a, an enormous window, and he can start killing near the ledge with it. Right, just playing off stage. There's going to be a back here. No, he just nearly whiffs it. Definitely would have been the stock, but he gets yep. the Paralyzer shot into the up B. That's going to do it for Hawk stock. And despite having some rage, uh, Hawk does not fall out. I know Ike falls out sometimes. It's not like Bay or Cloud where he falls out like all the time, but Ike is, uh, from my experience at least, like one of the more like prone characters to falling out. Gotcha. I could just have bad luck with boost kick, though. <laughs> <laughs> I still, to this day, don't understand the uh, boost kick. I watch Triforce's, Trifos, Trifos's video, and I'm still like, uh, oh, my God, yeah, that window a, is that, huge. That was from center stage. Yeah. That was from center stage. Like, I, okay. Like, as a Zero Suit player, this matchup kind of feels like a grappler matchup to me, uh, just because that, like, connects for so long. Oh, I actually whiffing that forward air off the uh, up the row. So Kaysen still in the driver's seat, trying to end this stock before Hawk is able to build Rage on his Ike. There's going to be a punish. He actually spot dodged through that second hit, too. That was pretty nice. That down tilt, forward air, forward air. Still trying to get, still trying to keep Kaysen in disadvantage. This will be the nair to the All back right. air. That was clean conversion. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, Kaysen's oh. going out there. Back air, punishing that flip kick. He's going to grapple to the stage. Patience from Hawk right now as he's trying to wall him out with these aerials. Cloud hits, I said Cloud. Ike hits hard with that, Ooh, that sword. Was good. Ike is heavy, man. I know that. Okay, that's going to be Not heavy it. enough to survive that back air. I know that second up air, especially since he went straight up, would have taken down a lot of characters, but not Ike. Not Ike. And now I'm actually curious. I actually kind of want to see uh, Kaysen. Oh, wow. The double Zelda. <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, as a zero suit player, from my experience, I feel like Ike falls out of boost kick a decent amount, but I'd actually like to know like the, uh, like the actual like statistics on that, if that's true, or if I'm just, uh, if I'm just bad or have bad luck with boost kick, I'm not sure. But, um, I believe the way like falling out of boost kick works is like, there's a lot that goes into it, but yeah. one of the biggest factors, um, and I feel like more than the opponent's percent is zero suits rage. Like, if you're fighting a Bayo or a Cloud, um, who are, like, very prone to falling out of boost kick, uh, they fall out a lot more often when Zero Suit has rage. Oh, yeah. All right, but so far, Hawk's starting this game, too, with uh, a lot a lot of punish game, I'll tell you that. Got him up to 61% before taking that 7% that you see on his next to his character portrait. Okay, so try and keep that pressure going. He's really good at keeping his opponents off stage. And that was amazing. Perfect shield. He actually punched that up air. That landing up air is fairly safe. It reminds me a lot of Captain oh. Falcons. <laughs> Those interactions are always so funny to me. Like two backers trade and they both go the same direction. Hits him, and that might do oh, it. Yes, it will. No, yeah. Hawk DI'd uh, straight out on those. Um, up air so that he'd be closer to the blast zone from the up B. And uh, I couldn't exactly tell what his DI was on the boost kick, but it might not have been optimal. Definitely not optimal given that situation, what yeah. just happened. What did, he, did he die off the top? I think so, actually. Yeah. He just instantly died. The second he left the vicinity, he was just gone. Probably wasn't down away then. 
All right, immediate grab. Just going to get that percent going. One more good conversion. Uh, Kaysen might be able to take this given this situation, especially a little bit more to the, to the sides of the stage. Hawk's still not out of this using use nice range and just I'm seeing a lot of full hops out of him. Mainly, yeah. it's ma it's really avoiding these zares that Kaysen keeps looking for, and at the same time, he can just throw out forward air whenever, and it'll auto cancel from that height, so he doesn't have to really deal with uh, Kaysen trying to catch his landing too much. Oh, the back air! No, how'd that whip? To be down throw. Ooh, actually, uh, was that a was that a, I, 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 a throw I have no read? Idea. I have I'm not no idea what that. that was. But I don't play Ike, so. Uh, I, I don't know. Ooh, back oh. air, awkward DI. Oh, oh no, Kaysen <laughs> just closes his eyes like, no, that's, that is bad. That killed so early, but you know, you can't be, you can't, you can't count on someone to DI the right way like every single time. Oh no. Stuff like that happens. And we are gonna be going into a game three between Kaysen and Hawk here. Sticking with the Ike and Kaysen sticking with the ZSS as we hell, hell, as we head to Dreamland. Oh god, the stage! I still remember taking uh, Nick Riddle to the stage, and I was like, I was like, I, was like, I look, I just remember you. I remember you commenting. Yeah, I You're commentated like, that set. Like, why did you go back to the stage? And I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> anywho, it's looking good for uh, Hawk so far. We're kind of seeing shades of uh, the early stages of Game One, where he just was getting. Solid punishes on whiff moves that Kaysen kept going out. And we'll be able to keep this lead. No, just a raw run of grab. No fear on Kaysen right now. Maybe a little one fear. No fear, one, one fear. fear. Rage boost kick, one fear. Just a little bit of platform play coming out from Kaysen. Trying to find a way to get past this wall that Hawk's pretty much setting up with these full hops. Just full hop fares. And he, no punish on it right there. Probably wasn't ready for it to hit his shield and just the hit stun that he was in. Just probably tried to mash a button, but just again wasn't ready for it. Still Hawk, just keeping the oh. pressure going. Reads the roll up air, up air, up air. Yeah. Just going to choose to juggle. Not going to get much off of those situations. It's definitely better to continuously go for those juggles as opposed to try and go for that boost kick, especially yeah. when you know it's a not going to kill or b will whiff. Yeah, I'm pretty sure boost kick would have just outright whiffed. Uh, if it did hit, it would have been like a very weak hit of it. Like literal, the, the literal toe of her, of her <laughs> stilettos. It definitely would not have taken the stock. I like that from Kaysen. Uh, he hadn't really like done a trump all game. Saving those trumps, catching your opponent when they're off, uh, catching your opponent off guard with them. Oh no! Dash attack! I don't know if that was intentional or not, but uh, yeah, Zero Suit's dash attack. <laughs> it is not the best. Yeah, crossing through shield definitely like can get you hit by some of those bigger moves. And that, that another dash attack, able to close out Case in stock. He's taking a deep breath right there, as you saw in the bottom left corner. He's trying to recompose himself. One, he really wants to wants to get out of winners. Uh, excuse me, want to get out of pools. I definitely need to wake up, man. I'm so tired. Jeez, <laughs> flubbing everything. But right now, Hawk, Hawk not flubbing any of his movement and punish options right now. Just perfect shields galore. Oh my gosh, Hawk. Back air spacing him out. You can tell Kaysen's getting a little frustrated. But at the same time, if he's able to close out this stock and get Rage on his side, he has the potential to bring this back. But getting off that ledge yeah. will be the start of this. All right, he does find his uh, escape option. Jab is going to uh, – Jab, like, it does so little damage, but it's so fast. And sometimes stage control is all you need, man. Awkward for the pressure. And missing that, that's probably going to be it. No, oh, yeah. he has it just right. He's out of range for it, probably because he has he has a ton of rage. Up, he out of shield, but he's going to land on that platform to auto-cancel it. And Hawk just throwing out moves. He's throwing out his strongest moves he can to try and end the stocking. Use all that rage he has. Yeah, I mean, why not? You're stock up. That that's it. Be it. Yep. And he Hawk is going to take that in advance into top 32 bracket tomorrow. Man, that's crazy. He rolled so many times from that ledge. And you know Kaysen had the read, but he just wasn't ready for it. Yeah, I don't know if he meant to, like, 